Nightmares continue this morning between issues with Southwest and the weather. And this isn't going away at least any time in the near future, because right now at MSP there are 34 canceled flights. 14 are delayed. Most of those cancellations, maybe you can guess, are Southwest flights. So we sent CC out to MSP again this morning to see what's happening. Hey, CC. Hey, Jen, yeah, this chaos really does continue this morning with nationwide Southwest canceling over 2500 flights. Now here at MSP, as you mentioned, over 30 of those cancellations are with Southwest here at MSP. If we look ahead to tomorrow, Thursday, they're already cutting over 1200 flights, so still operating at that one third of the normal flight schedule. Well, Southwest says it's blaming the storm that we got last week. It's also blaming aggressive flight scheduling and outdated infrastructure for these cancellations. Now, some stranded travelers say they probably won't get to their destination until after the new year. Until then, thousands are spending their nights at airports or waiting in long lines, and we can't forget unclaimed baggage is also piling up. The Southwest CEO is again apologizing for the chaos, but he says he's optimistic that the airline will be back on track very soon. Clearly, we need to double down on our already existing plans to upgrade systems for these extreme circumstances so that we never again face what's happening uh, right now. Our plan for the next few days is to fly a reduced schedule and reposition our people and planes, and we're making headway and we're optimistic to be back on track before next week. Meanwhile, Southwest is facing an investigation over this. Coming up in about 30 minutes, we're going to tell you what the Department of Transportation has to say about all of these cancellations, Jen. Okay, thank you, Cece, for that update. Well, passengers 